Hi, my name is uh, Aditya Jayasilan and I like doing art. I make uh, functional art. The biggest aha moment of the residency was to actually talk to everyone, see how their perspective is and to feel so relatable and to kind of, I wouldn't say fit in, but have conversations where people actually know what I'm talking about or, you know, listen to their new perspectives and kind of hear, you know, their views and ways of life and, you know, the way we had conversations with the entire community and the chance that we got to go, you know, spend some time in so many places and, you know, have like a whole bond with them and for them to be open and, um, you know, open to change and growth and how they are so motivated and to see different kinds of people. So there's, you know, people who want to be empowered, who feel empowered, and there's people who are still reluctant a bit. So you can see all those differences and you can see different kinds of people. And in the residency, I feel like I've met a lot of cool people, people who have become like almost like friends and, you know, you know, there's so much to take further. And even when I go back home, I probably rave about it for at least a month minimum. And I have so many things in my head that I want to create content out of, like in terms of, you know, how the residency was and, you know, the kind of people I met, the kind of work that you all do, the interesting conversations. And I love sketching. So a memory sketch of sorts and, you know, an illustration of everyone together or, you know, just a dinner table chat or, you know, just, just us going around the entire place. So one of the major conversations for me was when I spoke to, um, Idea? Idea? What's her name? The lady here? Ira. I, I, uh, yeah. I? Ira. Ira, okay. So the conversation with her was overwhelming for me, to be very honest. After the 45 minutes or one hour, when she teared up, I could feel it. And you know, the way she told, you know, she's the God for her family. So, you know, how, you know, she came about and, you know, what she's been doing all these years and how Hangama is for her, even though she's three, four kilometers away from this place and how, you know, people feel welcomed, how opportunities are created here, how community has become a whole new thing. I don't know if it's a greatest achievement, but I'm definitely proud of a certain few things. So. I got to really ground myself and humble myself through the entire process, like from where I was, you know, instead of, oh, I'm the girl who paints and creates art really cool. It came to a place where, you know, there's so much more the world has to offer. There's so much more I have to learn. And the kind of humbling and the grounding is, I feel like, extremely special for me and to work with different kind of communities. I've kind of worked with different labeled artists and how they think, how they create and how they talk about it, how they express about it. And also to take pride in saying that I am at a place that I'm very happy with the kind of work that I do, with the kind of, because uh, you know, I feel like I heal through my art and when it, is relatable to someone else that's like a completely you know it's a, it's it's magic and when someone else can connect to it someone talks about it and i love teaching kids so i enjoy that a lot what they can teach is way way more than you know what i can teach them So the one thing I would like to take and apply or many things that I would like to take and apply is be way open, be open to more conversations, be open to more of the learning, be open to community because back at home, which is Colombo, I don't feel like, you know, we thrive like this. This is a completely new way of, you know, not a new way, probably the ancient most way of living. So I really like this. Uh, you know lifestyle and you know having those important conversations where people are open to talk about it you get their input there's you know constant learning learn 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 think about it dwell in your own thought go inward so yeah that is kind of very inspiring very inspiring a lot to take back home definitely yes yeah.